To write the name for FeO, the first thing we need to realize is that iron, that's a transition metal. Oxygen, that's a nonmetal. So we have this metal, nonmetal. We're going to use these rules here to write the name for FeO. First, we write the name for the metal as it appears on the periodic table. Fe, that's iron. Next, we write the name for the nonmetal as it appears on the periodic table. O, that's oxygen, lowercase o. And then we replace the ending, this Y-G-E-N, with I-D-E. So far, we have iron oxide as a name for FeO. But remember, iron, that's a transition metal. When we have a transition metal, we need to write the charge here between these names in parentheses using Roman numerals. So we know oxygen, group 16, sometimes called 6A, that's always 2 minus. The iron, it has to be 2 plus for these to add up to 0, give us a net charge of 0. So we put our Roman numeral 2 in parentheses. So the name for FeO is iron 2 oxide. And the 2 in parentheses, that comes from the 2 plus on the iron. If you were given this name, iron 2 oxide, and asked to write the formula, you'd know the iron would be 2 plus, and you'd only need one oxygen for the charges to balance. This is Dr. V with the name and formula for FeO, iron 2 oxide. Thanks for watching.